Okay, today we're going to go over the different methods of burping a cartridge. We often get asked this from our customers, and we figured the best way to explain it would be to do a video on it. For the things you'll need is obviously the cartridge that you'd like to burp, uh, either a manual or a pneumatic gun, a plunger, static mixers if you like, a mixing tin for usage, or just an extra um, paper towel. Always remember to use nitrile or equally safe gloves and eye protection. The different methods that you can use is with a gun with a plunger inserted into the back of it or with a plunger we'll go over those, those methods right now. Okay the first method that's preferable is to use a uh, manual handgun with a plunger sitting in the back for the appropriate ratio of the cartridge. This particular cartridge is a 2 to 1 ratio and that's what we have in the back of the um, gun. So uh, first what you want to do is make sure the plunger is all the way back by pushing up on the button and pulling all the way back. Insert the cartridge into the gun to the appropriate way. There is one side that's bigger than the other and you would insert the cartridge in the exact same way. It just slips right in. Then you can put the cover over if you'd like. The next thing to do is to take off the cap just twist right off um, counterclockwise and you can pull it off just like that. The beginning step to burping a cartridge is to lightly grasp the gun in your hand and squeeze until the portion of the adhesive starts to come out and then just push until it comes out and you get equal portions of A and B coming out at the same time. Then you can either attach a static mixer which goes on the exact same method that the cap goes on by placing it there, turning it opposite way, which is cl clockwise, and you can put it on that way. We also have two and a half inch stack mixers if you need to use those as well. The cartridge is fully burped. You can either put the cap back on for future, future use, and it's ready to go. The next method of burping a cartridge is to use a just regular manual plunger and the appropriate cartridge. This is a 2 to 1 ratio plunger and obviously 2 to 1 ratio cartridge. Uh, first what you're going to do is get the plunger ready into the back of the cartridge. Then what you can do is take off the tip again in a counterclockwise fashion. So what we're going to do is by pushing pressure from the back of the plunger into the back of the cartridge onto the back plugs, you're going to slowly push until you get equal parts out of both A and B. So, I'm just going to push out a little bit and then that looks like the right amount. There's just minimal amount used. You have equal portions in the back and now your cartridge is burped. Now you can either attach a static mixer like we said before in either 6 inch or 2 inch fashion or you can reassemble the cartridge for future use. To dispose of the burped material, you can either finish mix mixing and throw it into the garbage. Uh, it is Once mixed, it's completely inert. Um, or you can mix it with the remainder of your adhesive. That's how you burp a cartridge with the materials um, that we have here today. You can purchase them Factory Direct or through our website, RealTechLLC.com. And thank you for watching.